Hello! In this video, we will present you the methodology of creation of geopolymer material based on clay and granulated blast furnace slag activated with a solution of sodium hydroxide. The first step is the preparation of clay. Before calcination, clay must be dried, ground and sifted through a sieve. Preformed clay is placed in a refractory crucible. It should be spread over the entire bottom surface of crucible. Filled crucible is placed in a cold furnace. After closing the chamber, furnace must be turned on and appropriate program must be selected. Clay is fired at a temperature above 600 degrees Celsius. Once furnace is cooled, crucible with burnt clay is pulled out of it. As can be seen, burnt clay differs in color from its original form. The next step is forming process. Fired clay, granulated blast furnace slag and a solution of sodium hydroxide are sequentially weighed. To a homogenized mixture of clay and slag, a solution of sodium hydroxide is added. The components are mixed by a mixer. Sodium hydroxide is the activating component. The prepared mix is placed in a silicon mold. 
the mold is placed on a shaker in order to thicken and distribute whole mixture. The next step is maturation of the samples. Molded samples are placed in a container filled with water for continuous supply of moisture required to support hydration process. After closing the container, the samples are left for a certain period of time for maturation. Hardened samples removed from the molds are subjected to further processing in order to prepare them for specific research or can be kept above water in sealed containers for further maturation. Thank you for your attention.